seeing this right now, it is purposeful, it is needed, and it is necessary. Listen, I want to speak to some of you who feel like you're in the wilderness, right? If you ever heard of the Egyptians, you ever heard of Pharaoh, you ever heard of Moses, well, when they actually left from Egypt, there was a wilderness of sin, wilderness of sin that they went into. But then I read all the way in Revelations that God prepared the wilderness for this woman. And he cared for her for about 1260 days. And so for any of you who may feel like you're in the wilderness, God has prepared it for you. It's a place of growth. It's a place of comfort. It's a place of healing. It's a place of strength. And when you come out, you'll be ready. Even John the Baptist was in the wilderness preparing the way. And when he left out the wilderness, he went to Judea and Jerusalem and all the other lands. So don't forsake your wilderness place. Embrace your wilderness place. Every acceptance is not a good thing. And every rejection is not a bad thing. Embrace your wilderness tonight. It's a prepared place.